caribou tena chez les imanis bienvenue chez nous nous sommes heureux de vous avoir et merci pour ceux qui sont en train de nous suivre pour le série qu'on a fait la semaine passée des chants de Swahili. on est toujours là mais aujourd'hui on a un autre qui nous est spécial et avant ça caribou papa promise <rire> Sans tarder, le chant de ce soir, c'est Great. Ok. Ok. Wow. Wow. You are great. You are great. Comment uh, est-ce que ce chant est venu? Actually, uh, the inspiration in Mekuja, I was, I was listening this song, I'll be honest. Kuna hii nyimbo ya Alimba McDowell, I think. Alimba na la 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 You know, I don't want to put it because what I thought I'm going to put it in So, quand j'ai écouté ce chant, et puis il y a une mélodie spontanée qui est venue dans ma tête. And it was like, you are holy, king of kings, you are holy, the king of kings. And then, when I went back home, I was like, let me write it down. And then just let me focus. So I, I start thinking about who God is. And then I went again through the Bible. And then that is Psalms 1994. Mm -hmm. The Bible talks about the Lord reigns, mm -hmm. he sits on the glorious throne, mm -hmm. all the earth shakes. Mm -hmm. They say, How marvelous you are, oh mm -hmm. God. I come up like, Oh, the Lord is great. He reigns over us, mm -hmm. He's watching over our lives. Mm -hmm. And now God's like, Yeah, the Lord reigns, He sits on the glorious throne. And then the mess, the melody came in, and we end up with the bridge, which the part that I love so much. For you are holy, okay. the King of Kings Almighty, and I made a song. Okay, and we did it with the Salem worship team like yeah. a couple times. Yeah, come on, I love Vizuri. Ninimbo ilitoka mnimbo ingine. Yeah, the inspiration actually was like kama vile spontaneous. Ika kujia ntipandi kandi katu mambo ya kato kia. Mm. Uh -huh, but the base. Unakumbuka you were in which kind of atmosphere? No, I was coming uh. from the uh from the rehearsal. Wow, I think we should have more rehearsals to yeah, get more actually, songs. Actually, that day also, I went to Korea, so Yasalem as well. Yeah. And I was in the bus. Most of the time, like, you know, <laughs> you just try to listen. But that day, I was listening to YouTube with my earphones, so I yeah. heard the song. I was like, wow, this song is really good. From there, I got the melody. Oh, that's mm -hmm. really good. Mm -hmm. For this song, Unongea uku wa mungu. Yeah. When we say God greatness, mungu ni mku. Mm. Yani unamanisha nini? What do you mean? I love the correction actually you gave me to. Mm -hmm. I'll be honest with that. Like, okay. Because um, unajua hii angliko matata. <laughs> the, the conviction I was uh, having when I, I wrote the song, mm -hmm. it was to express actually ukubwa na uzuri wa mungu. But okay. the most I was focusing Kuzuri wa mungu. Ah. When you gave me the correction about the greatness, mm -hmm. the way you understood it. Mm -hmm. So I, I was like, ah, so that's why the Lord reigns. Anatawala juya mambo yote. So ni ukubwa wa mungu walikuwa wanaongelea. Mm -hmm. Which is so good. But that time it was more about, mi ni kuwa nafikiri kwamba ni uzuri, the goodness of God. Yeah. And when we speak actually about the goodness of God, it also involves the great, like uh, the greatness Mzee. of God, because ni ukuba na uzuri wake unatawala ndani yetu. So it's more about kutangaza koma Dieu est bon, koma Dieu est grand, koma Dieu est capable, combien il est incomparable et personne ne peut se comparer à Dieu. Voilà un peu. Ukisema hivyo inanipatia tu. Unasikia heartbeat sina ongezeka. Unasikia una, una, like, ule vie mwenye unapendaka. Ndiyo. Uh, J'aime beaucoup imaginer Dieu comme mm. un papa la anakiaka kila siku anapangalia na kupatia smile. Mm -hmm. Ataka moyo doing so stupid stuff. Mm 
Mm-hmm. He comes and he says, "Hey, lomba msama. Nita kusame. I'm just, I'm still waiting for you. Mm. Bado ni nakusubiria. Bado I love you. And mm. ule mtu wa vile, it's ni mtu mwenye una develop na relation mm. ya bien. Humogopi ni vrevie. Kweli, like napenda vile umesema ulikuwa nafikiria uku wa Mungu lakini uzuri wa Mungu. Mhm. Na vile kuna ongea hivyo nakumbuka uh, what David said. Aseme kielom. Qu'est-ce que l'homme pour que tu te souviens de uh-huh. lui? Le fils de l'homme pour que tu prennes soin de lui. Donc, yani Mungu kwa uku wako uko nafanya nini na wanadamu? Kwa yeah. kikweli. Yeah. Una unawapatia eh? unawatofshanisha na wa saying that unanipatia Sijui hata niseme aje nadhani na mimi nafika kwenye ile ye, idea like unatafuta nini na wanadamu na yuko wako kabisa You just give me this idea mimi nazoea kusema mm-hmm. like tu vois un dieu parfois tunamkamataka Mungu uh-huh. tunamtia mka box uh-huh. as if siye Mm-hmm. Ndio tunamuelewa, tunaweza kumumanya, eh? Tunaweza kumujere gis tunataka. Mm-hmm. Mais je suis en train de voir un dieu mm-hmm. qui a créé mm-hmm. toutes choses qui existent. Sure. Qui contrôle chaque chose. Mm-hmm. Et à part ça, qui la mtu mu dunia iko anafata huyu mu. So weye uko sa vile kaincecte bona tena sexy na kwa kubwa baba. <laughs> eh hey, donc uko ka kitu yes, kenye na wewe uko na aspire kulu kitu. Mm. And sasa sijui kama bana simaka nini. Hata sungura ikule aye haiwezi fikiria tembo. Mm. Unaelewa? Mimi hii masiku tushaka kwa matembo Mungu akageuka sungura. I don't know if you understand what I mean. Ninailewa. So Mungu tunamuimagine kwa msini ni vyeo mwai vitu mwenye unaweza tufanya hivi unamtoka unafanya hivi una rentre unamjeregi si unataka but we have to remember kama hata kama una give up il reste Dieu. Mm. Et quand tu es avec lui c'est une opportunité parce que en tout cas we don't deserve atuna dura ya kukoa watoto wake. Lakini kwa mm. upendo Nee, et dans son humilité, il s'est fait même homme pour venir vers nous. En quoi bien mina kulove, na mina rukufia. Mm-hmm. Il est pendo. Kweli. Où le mutu a ville. Mm. Ana kupigania, mutu alikuumba, donc ana kujua, ana kumetrize. Kweli, vio na sema ville na kumbuka e verse na sema. Ah, c'est par la grâce que nous sommes sauvés. Et ça aussi, c'est le don de Dieu. Voilà, c'est à tout cas. Akuna tu lifanya. Ndo tu sema tu na mérité ukubwa wa Mungu. Na sana sana yeye umesema uzuri wa Mungu. Ah, uzuri wa Mungu unatosha is great is big. That's why every time when we go to him, kila wakati tukimsogelea Mungu, Ndi. be humble. Ujue kama uko naongea na mtu mwenye antuka au na tadrua ya kumsogelea. But mm. neema Mm. Il me kufanya ou disu. On est toujours là. Il y a une partie d'Aniai Nimbo inani bariki sana. Et j'aimerais savoir vraiment où le kunata kumaanisha nini. Unajua Mungu anasema munite na nitawajibia ni waoneshe maku yangu. Et il y a une partie il sait come and reign on us. Kuja utawale. Lakini when you say kuja utawale, qu'est-ce que vraiment tu veux dire? Ah. So always about submission. Mhm. Kujishusha. En tout cas moi j'ai appris Dieu que ai comme mtu wa kuzoea. Mhm. Unajua kama mtu anakuoneshea meno, ça ne veut pas dire que faut mnazoea. Okay. Il y a les gens qui seront humbles avec toi, mais cela ne veut pas dire qu'ils sont devenus tes amis. Mhm. Ah oui, faut na mkamata gisi unataka. Mhm. You understand? You submit yourself to God. Comme un signe d'humilité. Même la Bible dit que même Jésus, le fils de Dieu, en tant qu'homme, il s'est humilié devant le Père. Et c'est pourquoi Dieu l'a souverainement élevé. On est là. Alors, nous, quand je dis, 
come and rain on us. Mm-hmm. Come and rain on my, in my life. Nile mi nasema, baba, siwezi kujipeleka. Mi nataka ufanye vinyo unataka. The rain ile ni kuja uempoze ukubwa wako wala ukuu wako chuo ya maisha yako. Ukisema siwezi kujipeleka unamaanisha nini? Siwezi kuji kujijere ngwa niongeza okay. Kiswahili ya kunyumba. Mm-hmm. Siwezi kujijere mi mwenyewe. Mm-hmm. Niko na bezo ya msaada. Mm-hmm. Niko na bezo ya msaada. Ndio ile ninaongea like <laughs> ni 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 bebe baba. Unifanye vile unataka. Mm-hmm. Voilà. Me kama je je t'observe nikikuangalia mimi naona kwa mtu wa confidence lakini nini natuma unasema siwezi kujijere baba neema neema je neema ni paske unajua sheria au kwa na kuko wenye watu wakubali kwa supposé kukula bombo mhm mufami mm-hmm. okay let me say unakomalia mufami yenye bali kwa adopte mhm ce qui est vrai naturellement ou les baba wa ile nyumba wala bazazi ya ile nyumba mm-hmm. ndio bana kupenda parce que uko na wapapi wanaandika kama uko mtoto wapo mhm mais cela awezi you awezi ji plaindre que uta unazania kama watakutrete sagisi watoto wa ntoka mtumbe ya ule baba mhm unaishi kwa bad mhm unasikia na bali kulogota tu mubarabara njo neema ile tulipata kambele ya mungu mhm ona jamais mérité mm-hmm kukua watoto ya Mungu. Mm-hmm. Parce que vraiment ukiangalia Biblia kuanzia mwanzo mpaka presque kumwisho hakuna hata siku yeye anasema hata ngwa ni sema Afrika. Mm-hmm. Pour ne pas dire un petit comme moi. Mm-hmm. Mais leo je me mets debout je peux parler de la part de Dieu. Qui suis-je? Mm-hmm. Un néa parmi les rien. Mm-hmm. Donc Nehemiah kani logota Mm-hmm. Donc si na tacha kujitia kwa mbele ya Mungu. Mm-hmm. Bure. Ah, ni sema nini? Ukikuwa unapartage vile la parole qui vient c'est il est Paul anasema niko wa kukama nilipata neema ya kuzidia. Mm-hmm. Juu mimi nilikuwa mfanya dhambi kuliko wengine wote. Sure. Lakini neema ya Mungu kweli ilizidia. Yeah. Na ikatufanya watoto wa Mungu. Ah. Yeah, vraiment. Ah. Ça c'est vraiment profond. Ha, tu sais mais nini basi. Mungu atubariki. Alleluia. <laughs> Merci d'avoir suivi cette émission et à la prochaine. Merci beaucoup et que Dieu nous bénisse. Amen.